Welcome back. Well, hello. Hi, everyone. Welcome back to the... Uh, fuck, I was, gonna, I was just about to say 10-minute power hour. The 10-hour <laughs> minute power? The 10-hour power minute. Oh, it's been a while since I've seen any of those videos. Stop it. They're just choo-choos. You don't have any more of their jelly. They're sweet, delicious jelly. I don't want them. In fact, I could use some jelly myself. You are welcome for anybody who's wearing headphones. Because I have low hearts. Oh, uh, you know what? I was literally just thinking from last episode. I was like, there's me not many games I can play all day with a f with another friend. And Rock Band and Sims 1 are both it. They're both it. I would play those both all day. That Like a thing to do. Don't oh, gives me attack. Great. Great time to eat it, me. Thanks. Good job. <laughs> Great time to eat it, me. Uh, I guess another I think that would be close would be Minecraft. See, it's funny that you named those two because I showed you those two, so I should feel special. Yeah, you should. That's why I'm saying. I'm like, those are games that I can play that literally all day. <laughs> I actually am itching to play Sims again and just do nothing. That's interesting. Yeah, I know it'll you're like take burnt a out on It'll Sims take for a me while. a little bit. That's yeah. how Sims has always been. To yeah, me. no, I get that. I get that for just games, period. Like, I'll always like need a break from TF2 after playing it for a for a bun for a bit. And also with Minecraft, I'll fucking just take a break on it for like a solid year, but then I'll play the shit out of it for like six months straight. And I'm partly sure that the reason that <laughs> the series of Sims burnt out for us was because we were playing it off camera as well. Yes, <laughs> that too. We were, yeah. So we expedited we, us getting over we it. We had our own little uh, world that was great. We customized it, made our own like uh, virtual girlfriends because we're sad and lonely. But also had a grand old time. <laughs> we had our own house. We had our own house, yeah. Did I tell you? Yeah, I did. I don't know if I said it here, but that in Sims 2, they look like everything looks way better. We played Sims everything 2 for looks, a bit, and it was just weird because everything was able to be in first person, and that well, scared me. Yeah, but what I was I wasn't able. I, I what I was trying to get me. at is that in Sims 2, everything looks better and cooler, and plays better probably, but. But you can't marry anyone that you make in the game. And I think that's unfair oh, that to the lonely people. Stupid. That is very unfair. Like, what's the point? Yeah, you have to marry someone that they put in the game. You have to marry your perfect creation. You can't make your creation. dream person. Yeah. Also, it's more stamina efficient to just climb like that than leap. It's just faster to leap. Yes, but it's hey, not works. more time efficient. Yeah, I've like just said. It. Actually, <laughs> well, whatever. <laughs> um, But yeah. Uh -huh. I guess the closest game would be Minecraft, where I play that all day. That was that was my record for like longest amount of time I've played a game in one sitting. I just played it with uh, Chandler and my other friend Alex in a mm -hmm. Skype call for twelve hours straight, <laughs> mm -hmm. and it was on Valentine's Day. Well, me and Austin, <laughs> it was good times. Me and Austin, who it would be so cool if he could be on here at some point. Um played Rock Band. Rock Band 2 has... What, what the fuck? What? Yeah, I guess bleep, I should bleep. go to the shrine, huh? Yeah, the bleep bleep's the shrine thing. I mean, I want to go to that yellow spot, but I guess I could go to the shrine. Me and Austin played Rock Band 2, and Rock Band 2, I think the first one also, has a... And probably even the third or fourth. I'm just getting sidetracked, but... I'm same mood. There's a, a challenge if... Because Rock Band 2 is the only rock band worth playing the uh, career mode, if you ask me. Yes. Other than Green Day, of course. Um, we played through the career mode, and at the end, you there's a challenge to play all 84 songs in the game in one set list. Oh, jeez. And me and Austin did you that. just went through the whole... That sounds fun as fuck, honestly. Well, yeah, and that's why I know a bunch of songs that I would that never otherwise know. I'm and, trying to but the the problem is when you because it goes in order from like easiest to hardest. So yeah, when we got to the end, I remember Austin did like hard bass for the whole challenge, and I did expert guitar and vocals and whatever. And uh, at the end of the challenge, we got to a song where Austin kept failing on bass, <laughs> and yeah. it was like song number like seventy six or something out of eighty four. And I was like. <sighs> <laughs> like we're not gonna do this because you can't change your difficulty that far. Yeah. Uh, and 
So I remember I had to play the guitar until it got to the part where he would fuck up. And then I'd have to take the bass because it's like a bass solo, so there's not anything crazy on guitar. So happening. you took the bass. So I, we him. had to switch. We had to switch out for that part in the song. Oh my god! And it took us like six fucking times, but we did it eventually. And we actually did that challenge, and we were like, "Fuck yeah, we're amazing!" That's hilarious. But also, there was because the, there was two times that we tried to do that challenge, and. The first time, I think I might have kept my... No, no, no the, the time we did it, I think I had to keep my PlayStation on for like three days straight. Because he <laughs> went home and came back another day to finish it. But... But the first time we tried to do that challenge, we did like 50, 60 songs in, in like a night. And then... My fucking mom... Turned off the PlayStation. Oh my god. In the morning. Because you know how parents are. Yeah. They'll fucking come across a console that's still on and they'll be like, conserve energy. It's like, Which, why you know, is I'm, this I'm, on? I'm all for conserving energy, but god damn it, mom. Yeah, electric bill. But yeah, same. <laughs> you have no idea. You have oh no my idea. god. That, that's heartbreaking. Yeah, oh. so we fired oh, it back up oh. and had to try it again. Friend. Oh, I know. I know. Stay the fuck away from him. I know what's going on here. Now I'm gonna fight him. You're gonna fight him. I'm gonna use my bomb arrow. It's gonna do like nothing. It you probably will do like nothing. Are you ready? Boo! Bye! That was actually a good amount of health taken away. You know what? You have a fighting chance, I think. Shoot him with another arrow? I just tried. Did oh. it miss? What happened? Oh, it's because I have to reload! I have to reload. Oh my. Oh, okay. Yeah, you you can take him out. Do it. Look, it's basically like Shrek from uh, Resident Evil Four. Shoot him in the face, and that big stupid eye of his. Fuck. Oh, rip your bow. Do another one. You have like forty other ones. Yeah. We'll use a spiky one. That's like, oh, yeah, this I am good damage. I want to do that challenge though. Now, the eighty-four songs. Fuck. Because yeah. I'm trying to think of another. Um, I think the thing where I did that, which I can't really remember. I think we should, head. right? Yeah, we should do it. Uh, I think the closest I had to doing that was uh, TF2 and MVM. For those of you who do Ow. know TF2, you know exactly what I'm talking about. For those that don't, there's this mode called MVM, Man vs. Machine. And if you've you played Balloon Towers Defense before, right? Oh, of course. Yeah, okay, like everyone has. It's basically something like that, where you're all on the same team and just you have to fucking fight against a horde. It's just like a whole horde style of robots and shit. And it's so fun. I could actually play that for, like, actual ever. Yeah. And the thing is, though, it costs money to do. It costs, like, $1 to do, um, like, a mission, I guess. And each mission has, like, six or seven different waves to it. And when you do, like, a certain, like, uh... Ow. ...package or set or whatever, a tour, you get a reward. And that's, like, four or six, uh, missions. So it's, like, four or six dollars to do for, like, every tour. For, like, every mission. Tour. Whatever the fuck. Four or six dollars for every tour. Try <laughs> Bear with me here. Um, every mission takes, like, an hour, and I would just have, like... It was mostly Alex at the time. We would just be over at my house, and we would just fucking play MVM, like, all night. And that would be, like, 20 bucks or something. <laughs> I don't know. So this I guess that's my equivalent. The point is to play it, though, is at the end of the tour, you can get something that costs a good amount of money. Yeah. But it's, like, really rare, and I've done, like, 60 fucking tours, and not once have I gotten anything, like, actually worth something. That's like Clue Scrolls in RuneScape. It's what is? That, what you're describing. Is it, is it like, uh, the Horde style? Or like, you, there's a chance you can get something neat? Uh, actually... Or both. I missed a lot of what you said, but okay. the thing where... It's like, you do it and then it's randomized that you can get something really good. Or just like... Okay, yeah. Literally anything. It's like a Clue Scroll. But... It's probably actually more like the mini games in RuneScape. If you're saying like you, what do you do? You fight shit. Yeah, it's just like robots. It's like literally horde style. Like think Left 4 Dead, but 
robots and different waves. Okay. And I like, don't know. It, it gets more. It, there's diff, diff, different difficulties for each tour. Like there's the really easy one, and like the the hard ones is where it can drop you like the really good shit. Like the, the Australian weapons, the ones that are just fucking gold. Okay, so it's not. I don't know. Maybe it's more like a mini game in RuneScape. Well, it's a mini game in the game, but yeah. Yeah. It's actually like one of my favorite things to fucking play. Okay. Still to this day, bars. All right, but yeah. Well, uh, see you next time. Cool. Hope you enjoyed my TF2 ramblings. Uh, part 47.